put an unboxing video. These are some uh, 45 pound plates that I got. And I'm just trying to set up a traditional camera view so we can record this in multiple ways. Um, so I thought, you know, I should buy a different different set of 45s, but then I, I changed my mind. I ended up getting a set that I already got, but, uh, uh, you know, man, I want to talk about making new videos. Uh, if I get different weight plates, you know, we can obviously unbox them, I can compare them, I can do this, I can do that. But, uh, unfortunately, <laughs> I also have this thing where I like my stuff to match. So, um, I don't know why I'm not using a box cutter, folks. I think I've got one under. What I'm doing with these scissors is kind of dangerous. So, there's a box inside of a box. Um, let's go ahead and get that out of here if I can. Let's see if I can box cutter right around the corner. I think I left it. Yeah, there we go. So I just recently picked up a used commercial incline, a Nautilus commercial incline, and now I'm thinking, God, why don't I buy more 45s? It's such a waste of money, right? But when you're lazy and you don't want to carry the 45s from one bench to another bench, and it's kind of a good idea. All right, so and there we go. Fine. Now I've been lifting heavy things all day today. Oh. Actually, the same four objects. The incline bench was four heavy pieces, and I had to put it together, which I didn't really need to get it put together just yet. So there's one cap 45. As usual, a little overspray, crappy painting. I don't know why people make a big deal out of it. Not sure why I do either. Um, it's just it's like sloppy work, right? But in the end, the things that matter are that it's not it doesn't come in cracked or broken, and there's no rough spots. So in that aspect, it's good, right? All right. Now, if weight plates were a little more equal, we'll say if the odds of them being within, you know, pretty much the same thickness and actually being 45 pounds and not 45.25 pounds or something, then I would potentially buy, you know, I would have bought two different plates here. Oh. And we would have, you know, been able to compare them. And that's always, I always like to get them to do that because, you know, somebody might actually be like, hey, which plate's better? Well, this one's the same price as this one. The diameters are different. They look kind of hokey if you don't buy the same plate as I found with the, the balance round plates that I have. They're smaller in diameter. Of course, the cap ones are smaller in diameter than the, uh, standard dumbbell as well so that kind of sucks <sighs> all right so we have our 45s and these will be i almost want to put the cap 45s on my new incline because most of the time 
time I won't need but um, 245s on there now if I put a slingshot a mad dog slingshot or bench daddy sling and I want to impress people you know and <laughs> I'm not really impressing anybody probably not but if I wanted to go really heavy then I need a, another 45 right so part of me thinks ah we should buy a third 45 we'll never do four plates on the incline at least I don't think we ever will um, not without some performance enhancements so there you go folks thanks for checking out the video please like please subscribe thank you all right